Everyone, it's Ross, and we've been getting tons of rain here. Um, I wanted to make this video to show you guys what rain, and lots of it, does to our figs. And um, here's some that I picked today. They were getting attacked by bugs or had all kinds of mold on the bottom. Some have been falling off, as this one did. Uh, a lot of them have been splitting or have mold in the cracks. Just there's mold all over these. The, the, these two here were getting attacked by tons of insects. You know, there's so many insects here. I've never, I've never seen so many insects in my life. Uh, different types from all over the place. You know, here's another fig here that split. Um, so lots of splitting that occurs. See there. Even my first Black Madeira KK has split. You can see that there. We're going to pick it because we shouldn't really get much rain today. Shouldn't get much rain tomorrow, but uh, this is not going to change. Look how large this fig is. They're almost always larger in the rain with a lot of water. You get these large, split, tasteless figs. We also have uh, Cavalieri here, which is one of my new favorite figs. It's been splitting like crazy, even just totally down the side, not even at the eye. It's just been splitting on the side of the fig. That's pretty crazy. Um, I don't think it's a variety really well suited for my climate. And... This is, you know, a bad thing, obviously, but it's also sort of a good thing. You have to see this in action to make good decisions on what varieties you should keep and which you should not. So far, it seems like my Italian 258 is a complete winner here in the rain. It doesn't seem to bother it. It doesn't seem to bother my Smith. So... When these figs are ripening, guys, you need to pay close attention to what's coming in the forecast. Pick your figs early, unfortunately, and then see how they, you know, see how they do in the rain. And if they're splitting, like really uh, a large majority of my figs are splitting right now. And if they're doing that, then that's a great sign of a fig of something you don't want. I would much rather have a fig like. Let's say this is my Brandon Street Unknown. It has two figs on it right now that have been ripening in this rain, haven't been splitting, haven't been spoiling. The insects have been pretty much not bothering it. You know, this is the kind of fig that you want. Anyway, I definitely envy a lot of you guys that are in warmer drier climates. This is just something we have to deal with sometime around mid-September and onwards. The season really starts to slow down. Things get colder. Uh, and this has just been a little bit of a PSA for all of you guys who live in a place that I do. Uh, I also want to say to those that are in North Carolina, stay safe because you guys are getting a hurricane relatively soon. I'm going to be getting a lot of rain because of that this weekend. So yeah, just everybody stay safe. By the time you're probably watching this video, it probably already happened. So hopefully everyone got through it all right. And uh, I'll talk to you all later. Take care.